words in Arabic apart from the ones in Yababa if you learn if you learn more um, well I used to uh, I used to have the whole Quran uh, which is the Islamic book uh, I used to basically memorize the whole thing so I could pretty much read and write Arabic yeah so that should answer your question do you have any haters if so what do you say to them if you do what do you say to them people only hate it's like a superficial thing, like people don't actually hate people, physically hate somebody Unless it's a form of kind of jealousy, and actually jealousy is kind of like, it's it's flattering if someone's jealous So I think everyone has haters in, in all walks of life If we don't have haters or critics or whatever you want to call them Then I don't think we're going to be able to develop or evolve as artists If everyone's trying to bumlick me, excuse my French, or trying to tell me how amazing, how amazing I am Then how am I going to move forward and appeal to new audiences without the critics? So, thumbs up <laughs> Um, I know a lot of singers don't do that. Uh, so when you sing in Rakin Raz Razumaki, sorry, I am Razumaki, uh, said when you sing in songs in Urdu, Punjabi and Hindi, do you understand the language? Um, I do mostly actually, I never understood it at first, so a lot of the songs that I, I sang before I didn't really know. But in the past two and a half years I have kind of started to learn what everything is, so yeah, I do understand a lot of what's going on. That's why one of the reasons why my lyrics are really simple and basic. I want to understand it, otherwise I'd be singing on stage and I'd be like saying something really emotional, but then doing a stupid dance move wouldn't make any sense if I didn't understand it. Hello.